Alan Yon in the familiar Team Lokai Red. Team Lokai, Team Philippines 2-0 so far tonight. Can they go 3-0 with Balignon? 13 centimetres tall like Juan Juan Hill. A oh, head kick from the South Korean. Some Taekwondo stylings early on. Immediately, Kevin Bellingon goes to that spinning back kick, and there was a nice little deflection from Quan Wan Il. He says that Kevin Bellingon is a one trick pony, and he's going to be able to stop that spinning back kick in it when it comes. And he's going to try to look to time that right hand right over the top of his lead hand. I don't know about being a one trick pony. Wushu is a striking martial art that has a lot of tricks up its sleeve the spinning back kick is one of them the side kicks another the short hands on the inside it's a trademark of all the team Lukai brothers yeah kevin bellingon has a massive right hand he's got great timing but he's also got a variety of kicks as well not just that spinning back kick you can see the movement is constant from Kevin Bellingon. There's that spinning back kick again. But Quan Wan Hill is applying a lot of pressure right now, looking for that knockout. I reckon Andrew Leone still has nightmares about that kick, Dragon. Oh, yeah, 100%. And it's going to live forever on it. Kevin Bellingon's highlight reel. Now, this is what I talked to Kevin a lot about. It was these takedowns. He says that Quan Wan Hill's Achilles heel is going to be that takedown defense. He's going to be able to get it down and really look. Bibiano Fernandez, what was it? Four times? Yeah, they met four times. The quadrilogy. One one who looking to leapfrog the entire division with a win here over Balignon. Yeah, and what a statement it would be to shake up the rankings like that. Roundhouse kick there. Balignon gets him the canvas on his back. What can Kevin affect from here? Drives a knee into the head. There's an elbow. Flurry of punches from Kevin. Nice catch to sweep out that support leg coming from Kevin Bellingon. But it was a good job by Juan Juan Hill to pop right back up and continue on that pressure. These looping and scooping punches of Juan Juan Hill are always so dangerous, Dragon. Yeah, his punching is so slick and it's so straight, but he's also got beautiful uppercuts and hooks as well. So he utilizes the entire array of boxing weapons. But now he's also mixing in the kicks as well. Body shots from Kevin, just gets out of range of that harpoon of a right hand. There's the uppercut again from Quan Wan Il. Following Kevin around the circle, shadowing him. Kevin backs him off with a right. That's what Kevin needs to do. He needs to answer back. He does not want to allow Quan Wan Il to keep this pressure on. It's constant pressure coming from Quan Wan Il right now. No single leg sprawls out nicely though, does Quan Wan Il. Thrust the jab again. Kevin on the outside, there's that scooping right hand once more from Quan. High knee, Kevin with the counter overhand right, doubles up on it, good forearms guard against the round kick and carries the front kick. Kevin needs to earn the respect of Quan Wan Il. Quan Wan Il is just walking him down at this point, coming forward continually in his face, looking for those hands. Nice little knee there on the entry. Kevin was staggered by that momentarily. Quan Wan Il's got his confidence oozing through every pore at the moment. Kevin backs him off with a right, another overhand right there from the Filipino. Yeah, that's what he needs to do. Also, maybe take out those legs too. Start throwing that calf kick even to the thighs as well, just to slow down this pressure coming from Quan Wan Il. Nice right, right hand. hand. Backs him off again. Smack bang to the orbital of Quan Wan Il. Kevin bites down on the gum shield. He's got grit and determination, the former world's champion. Big leg kick up ends him. Beautifully done from Kevin. I think Quan Wan Il actually tried to jump over the leg kick on that time. Kevin could wound up for it. High low goes Quan Wan Il, changing levels with his kicking arsenal. Juan Juan Hill is actually a Taekwondo black belt, so expect those kicks to come and also look pretty fancy while he's doing it. He was actually a champion in his elementary school days in Taekwondo. Taekwondo, the national martial arts of Korea. Developed by General Choi. Also an Olympic sport, of course. This is a similar pace Quan Wan Il is competing at, similar to the what uh, he did with, against Chen Rei, how he was just constantly on him, never giving him a break to breathe, never giving him a chance to reset and sort of rethink his strategy. I like this pressure coming from Quan Wan Il, but Kevin, in the latter part of that round, he was able to start landing shots and earn the respect and also just kind of score a little bit on the judges' scorecards. Amastas Kamabai and to everyone in the Philippines, looking 
looking to go 3-0 tonight. Team Philippines led by the man here in red, Kevin Bellignon. Here's Kevin trying to stay true to his word with the takedown attempts. He tried two of them, but Quan Wan Il was able to pop right back up. See, he didn't control the hips there, so it's not really counted as a takedown, but he does get credit for the aggression on the takedown attempt, but it doesn't score really as a takedown. But then Quan Wan Il just keeps coming with those hands, keeping his feet underneath him, and a lot of pressure coming from the Korean Quan Wan Il. This is our Christmas gift to you, folks. The last show of 2021, and what a cracker it's been so far. Can Kevin Bellignon make it 3-0 for Team let's Philippines, go. or will Quan Wan Il spoil the party? as he told us he would earlier this week. Punk kick there from the Korean. Good jab to a high kick. Duck under from Kevin. Flurries back at a high kick of his own. That's what Kevin's got to do. He's got to answer the pressure of Quan Wan Il with flurries. He's got to put combinations together. He's having a hard time kicking off his back foot. He's not really scoring with it. But when he goes first and when he pushes forward, he's able to connect. Both men, interestingly, have a physique ideally suited to their striking art. Quan Wan Il carries that long, lean, lengthy Taekwondo physique. And Bellion's got the shorter wushu style body. It works well for them. I like how Quan Wan Il switches stances to southpaw and then throws that rear leg left kick. It's nice. Oh, oh liver shot. shot. Liver shot folds him in half like origami. And Quan Wan Il has knocked out Kevin Bellion. Wow. What a statement by Quan Wan Il. Drives the knuckles between the ninth and tenth. Mr. Justin Brown has called a stop to this contest after 52 seconds in the second round for your winner by way of knockout. Go on, on, in. 